Hello everyone, and welcome back to an epic. And so now then, to get more pieces out with the shield, and bureaucracy. Yeah, fun times. And so we're going to be using that scale for a while. Hopefully we don't buy any trusters though. Because if it gets turned into a toy hammer, yeah, bad stuff is going to happen. I can't be doing accountable for my actions. But yeah, can't. Gantron's pretty much the only way I can actually fight these guys, though. Alright, so, let's see. Go back over here. Check and make sure those aren't bots, though. I remember who I have to talk to. Request a comment. I'm going to fish a minion. Okay, so now I have to figure out who I have to talk to about this one. You want me to wait? You want me to just wait yeah, in So yeah, I could cover all the dialogue, but it's you want, so what's it look? It's basically a lot of freaking paperwork. I can't really remember who I have to talk to in the right order. I probably could have looked it up to save myself time, but oh well. I go into the fish for sale. I know the one with the three spots is. You one. want wait? You think you can do this job better? And where in the deep? You want me to? So what's an A? Look. We need an A and <gasps> Dray. Dray. <gasps> something. Legislative <gasps> approval. Me to certify an A and so what's an A look? Just you want me to just hand you an A N two hundred? Wait, you think you and in the deep? Herp, herp, herp. What? You think I just keep signed AN200s lying? I see where- That's not- So I need the AN train train to get up there now. Eh. 
Yeah. I already covered the bottom. You won't wait, you stand in. Did the bone scarves go into? Go take it to these people. Yay. Super. You want me to s so what's an A look? Okay, so go over here. Now go back here. You want me to certify an A and so what's an A look? like this. This is just, you know, tedious. There's no other word for it. We're going to make a quest like a DMV. Because we hate the player. We want him to suffer. Oh, do I finally have a thing? I might finally have a thing. There we go. The f certificate of the. I almost got mad. There we finally, go. Finally, um, um, to obtain certificate. I pleased. I give bone breaker. And now we get bone breaker. And we lever up. Bone breaker, by the way. This weapon's magic allows it to attach several targets at once. It's a mace. We don't use maces. So it's not really that useful to us. Yay. But we complete the then we leveled up from it. Eh, give me some next scalper. Oh god, not slippery hands. Mm. How do I hate slippery hands? Because it does that. Okay, so now we just have to figure out what the chests are. Watch our slippery hands. And now we're going to die. This slippery hand sucks so much. Okay, let's try this again. It's not much better. Probably now. 
Okay. Okay, focus. Oh yeah, I just realized something first thing. Yeah, I can't get up now. Fire and frost, but more armor, a lot more armor. Maybe I should have been using that against them, but it does protect against poison. Nothing really protects against poison, though. Because poison's just a dick thing. Decide where to go from here. I think I'll go back here. Okay. I can't see with chest up though. You should tow us out. Okay, is there a chest over here? Yes, up there. Shane's house is here with those freaking bats again. Gatchan's not the best for fat handling that many bats, though. Oh, 
Hadouk. Seems like a good use of my fireballs. But uh, I think I already got that one. We need to get over there, though. The one next to the ladder. That's not the one next to the ladder. And I'll be annoyed by these things. They do no damage to me and waste that chance energy. Oh crap! I forgot they could do that. Okay, totally running. Yeah, I'm throwing those slippery hands over oh, them. Okay, now then. Ah, crap, it's decrypt. I guess I have them all now, and that's good. It is good. So that means we're almost done with the halls. Yay. Ugh, I hate the halls. I mean, just imagine trying to do this without Gatchan. Yeah. It would be like the previous video where we just basically <laughs> ran from 90% of the fights. Well, more like 99.9% .9 of the fights. Because even trying to fight was just, just bad. Because you're poisoned, you're on fire, you lost your weapon, your weapon turned into a toy hammer. Ave, spirit of protection. I bring you the items as requested. Fantastic. Now I will transfer my knowledge to you through the power of this artifact. Let the magic of protection cover you against your foes, that runes written in the past become readable to your eyes. Yay. The magic of protection has been added to your character sheet. Uh, you are now able to cast spells of protection and increase your skill in protection magic when gaining levels. Protection magic. Great to protect fly or over you that sort. One third of the damage in melee attacks. Melee attacks are not the problem. There's only one more th part to deal with the boss. And that's the boss. The 
boss is going to suck, though. Because I have to use basically magic against him. I hate. Can't screw these things. I don't think I need this anymore. Or this. Eh, or this one. I probably also don't need this picture card. But I'll put it in my bank. I'm gonna keep that just in case I go back to a place where I need brave attention. So anyway, this boss. An invoker! Hey Zero, what can you tell me of this critter? Here dwells Mediox. His power is so incredible that he petrifies his victims just by looking at them. Petrifies with his eyes? Let me guess. Does this Mediox have lots of snakes on his head? He does. How did you know? He must be the brother of Medusa. I will do what Perseus did. Separate his head from his body. Body? Mediox has no body. He is just a head hidden behind an impenetrable silver helmet. Listen to me, stupid human. His power resides in his central eye. You must avoid his petrifying gaze at any price. If you feel his gaze approaching, turn away and you'll be saved. Something else. His snakes spit a poison that kills quickly. Have at hand all the anti-venom potions you can carry. You are going to need them. I don't so, have any. <laughs> no looking it in the eye. Yeah, crap. Understood. Come on, let's go. I fear I will never return to my castle. So, yeah, I should have brought anti venom. Crap. Well, this is gonna suck. Oh boy, is it gonna suck. It's gonna suck like so bad. We've been poisoned. We're doomed.
I think he murdered my pet. I'm not entirely sure. That used like over 500 of my red essence. Key of the town. Thing is, catch her. <laughs> tree is alive. Yeah. <laughs> Game. Good thing also is we don't have to ever, ever go back to the tower. Go back to the halls. Yay. Where's the uh, seashell? Games. So next time, the tower. If I can. Hmm. Maybe that way to the tower? Depends which tower. This tower? That tower? I'm not sure. So I like two areas left, though. Ah, 
but we'll worry about that next time. Uh, I need a break after that. I mean... The halls are just... That's like the worst area for me. I, I don't know. I can't remember what's in the towers. So it might be worse. I remember the very end game is tedious as hell though. But I wouldn't say it's as bad as, I mean, the halls, that was, uh. And Gatchan is overpowered, I mean, Gatchan basically nullifies pretty much any enemy. When you see my methods for fighting most enemies, I just basically attack, 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 get hit. What? It's more of attack, get hit, attack, attack, and hopefully I can kill it before it attacks again. So, I always usually get hit once. The problem with the halls, though, is poison, fire, things that basically make you drop your weapon, things that make your weapon into a toy hammer. It's just not good for trying to actually fight. So anyway, next time, we head to the tower. Fun times. Hope you all enjoyed. Thank you all, and have a nice day.